to a different approach to growing food and eating food, and it's taking organic farming to a whole new level, and that's the real reason special anchor Maria, Maria Shriver is here. Good morning. Good morning, all of you. I'm well supported on all fronts. Wow. Well, welcome to Beyond Organic, as Savannah said, and just as shopping, eating, and growing organic has become more popular, there's now something new, and it's called biodynamic. It's an, actually an ancient closed-loop method of farming that plants and harvest according to the cycle of the moon. It differs from organic in its lack of pesticides and its emphasis on soil health. And its proponents believe it holds the key to a healthy mind, a healthy body, and a healthy spirit. On 26 acres tucked well into the Malibu Hills is a place where wild things grow and roam. There's squash, radishes, and cilantro. And there's also Eleanor, Romeo, and Waffle. It's called One Gun Ranch, but you'll find no guns here, just rescued animals and a lifestyle called biodynamic, a step beyond organic. It's our heart and it's our passion and it's our love. Alice Bamford and Anne Eisenring own and run One Gun Ranch, a place where they practice the ancient art of biodynamic farming, an all-natural way of growing and harvesting food from the earth. We don't use any chemicals, any pesticides. It looks at a farm itself as its own living entity. Everything that is used is then recycled back to the land. And the primary focus on biodynamic farming is soil and soil health. And you're saying that this is what makes all the difference. This is what that. makes the magic happen right, right here. The super soil is the magic and they make it themselves using a 100-year-old recipe, filling it with medicinal herbs and letting it cook for nine months before use. The results? Simple food bursting with flavor and nutrients. You can taste it. You can wow. taste the difference from our food strong. anybody else's. It's wow. strong, it's peppery, it's vibrant, it's alive. They grow for the local community and some names you might have heard of. Wolfgang Park um, takes all our passion fruit. But they also grow for a larger purpose. So you look at everything that you're growing here, everything that you're eating, everything that you're selling, really as food as medicine. Absolutely. That all of these plantings have medicinal properties to help people physically and or mentally. Completely, 100%. The soil is so nutrient rich that UCLA used it in both their community and medicinal gardens as part of their healthy campus initiative. And separately, One Gone Ranch has begun to grow marijuana high in CBD, the medically rich portion of the cannabis plant for cancer treatment. Alice knows not everyone has access to the One Gone Ranch lifestyle, but she believes everyone can be conscious of what they eat. Anyone can connect to good food. She has written a book designed to educate people about the benefits of biodynamic life. And she regularly invites groups like School on Wheels, which provides volunteer tutors to homeless kids, to the ranch to learn about where food comes from. We work with a lot of schools and a lot of charities and children who don't necessarily have the best start in life. Alice knows exposure helps create reality. And for children who may never have seen the ocean, a farm animal, or know where their next meal is coming from, the impact is immediate. Oh, see it, see it. Usually when I have healthy food, does it taste good? <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like really good. And like different spins on stuff, like I've never had like roasted watermelon. The carrots were the bomb. <laughs> the carrots. Well, the tacos, they were delicious. This is the yeah, the lettuce tacos were really good. They're not confined within a room, um, you know, shelters, emergency shelters. And so as you can imagine, coming here, somewhere like here, is extraordinary for them. It's a very, very beautiful place. I just love it. I know you're trying to teach a new generation of kids and kids who might not have ever been to a place like this about what's in their food and to think of food in a different way. Absolutely. To think of food in a different way and think of the ground in a different way. And therefore to think of their lives in a different exactly. way. Exactly. Definitely.
Okay, we know um, that biodynamic yeah. farming isn't for everybody, mm -hmm. but you know, it is actually gaining in popularity and they're very smart about going to the farmer's market and giving you questions what to ask for because not all organic farming is the same. Some organic farmers do use pesticides, so they want you to really be aware of what you're putting into your body. And I thought it was really interesting because they don't take antibiotics, they're never sick, and they really believe wow. that the food we put into our bodies affects our mood, affects our mental health, and obviously affects our physical health. And when you hear a kid say the carrots are the bomb, yeah. Yeah, yeah, they're doing right. something and they're right. they're aware because California yeah. is an agricultural state and so many people don't even think of it that way. Yeah. So I want sure. you to think about that. You're going to go out and eat some barbecue. Yeah. As we do that in just a little while. That's right. <laughs> Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.